Respond law is us being responsive to every aspect of the client's problem or issue and getting them to a successful resolution. If you reach out to any one of us, we're going to quickly get back to you. And since I've adopted that uh, line of thinking, I've seen an increase in the practice as a result of that. It started with uh, a number of friendships. Um, Ed Eastman and I had gone to law school together. We became friends. There, I didn't have a, a place to live, so I ended up on the couch. When I graduated and needed a job, Dwayne found me one. Each of us had different strengths and different weaknesses, but we capitalized on that. People, property, and progress, we want to grow with you. And if we can't help you, we'll find somebody who can help you. But that's what the firm's interested in doing. It's interested in building relationships with its clients. I think my favorite part is helping people. I've had quite a few situations where people are really in crisis, and we can really guide them through some difficult times. The reason they're coming to a lawyer, you know, in general is because they need a problem solved. Whether that's they need a will, they have a piece of litigation, they're, they're buying or selling a house, right? So it also gives them comfort when they can, you know, talk to somebody such as myself to be able to put their, you know, fears at ease and be able to sleep well at night. The people here, you know, they're not bound together by practice. They're not bound together by family or relationships. What they are is a diverse group of highly talented professionals that want to practice law together. The brainstorming is one of the, I think, the key advantages of a large firm. Isn't it wonderful? You can walk down the hall and sit down and say, hey, I got this issue. What do you think? We're here to listen, and that's part of people, property, and progress. You have to invest in who your clients are and learn about them so that you can help them move forward. Our job is to make them as comfortable as possible in doing that and to make them feel that they're heard, they're understood, and that their needs are being addressed by somebody who not only has the technical proficiency to do it, but somebody who cares about the outcome for them.